Welcome back. Let's move the camera. So we're here in Ship Creation Controller, which will be doing the handling of the movement. As usual, um, Unity has by default created some of the axes we would normally need, so we'll just grab them. So we want our uh, panning here to be on the same plane. We don't want to move up or down. Uh, so therefore, we need to ensure that some of uh, we need to ensure that we don't move up and down. Uh, so transform dot position plus equals hors times transform dot right. Now this is always going to work out fine because transform dot right will always be on the same plane. We'll never be tipping the camera left or right. But on the other hand, when we look, we're going to be looking at an arbitrary angle forward. So we need to have a vector 3 forward. We need to have a forward angle. And we're going to use transform.forward. But what if we're looking straight down like we are right now? We also need to have transform.up. That way we'll never have a situation where we get a divide by 0 error. There we are, times time dot delta time. Um, so the other thing we want to do is we want to multiply it by a factor of how high we are off of the ship so that as we zoom in our panning becomes slower so we'll be able to manage it better. Like that. Alright, shall we see whether or not that works? It doesn't because I forgot to delete something. Sorry, this is something I should have deleted before. Um, it, it has no bearing on what we are doing now. I was just goofing around. Alright, so panning, panning, panning. Works great. So next we want to do some tipping. Changing the camera angle um, is not that difficult, but we only want to do it when we are middle clicking, because um, otherwise we'll have a hard time actually uh, moving the mouse cursor around. So if we're middle clicking, then we want to do this stuff. All right. So um, we can tip the camera easily enough, but now well, let's go ahead and start by tipping the camera. So let me go ahead and show you why simply rotating is a bad idea. Unlike a first-person shooter, we don't have a world to look around in. All we have is this one patch, and as we rotate we lose track of the patch rather too easily. So what we actually need to do is uh, make it so that uh, we are always pointed at the specific location that we were pointed at. So because we're always looking at the zero point on the y-axis, we don't have to even array cast. We know exactly where we're going. Hmm. I hit pause because something noisy was happening and I kind of lost track. Oh yeah, we were broadcasting forward along the transform. So, um, just to make this as clear as possible, This is how high we are off the ground. And then this is how quickly, how, f how close, how much we are looking at the ground. This will be 1 if we're looking straight down, and it'll be like 0.5 if we're looking at a 45 degree angle forward. So what we want to do is we want to take our current target and add in transform.forward times 
y delta divided by y speed. Um, the only issue is that this will actually be a negative value, so we need to go ahead and we're going to math that up as both of these, just in case uh, someone decides to look at the sky. We don't want to we don't want to have an error where we start to go crazy. All right, so this should determine our current target, which will be at uh, some point. Uh, we'll go ahead and just debug.log current target, just to make sure that we have it correct. So we're going to go back into Unity and hit play, and hit mouse key, and you can see that we have down here, the, I'm pointing like you can see, down here we have a host of different numbers, but all of the y values are zero, which is exactly what we want, because we're, we're trying to point at zero. So what we're going to do is we're going to make it so that uh, our range from our current target will always be the same. So down here, after we've rotated, we simply take our current target, and we subtract our transform.forward um, times our delta. So we're the same range away, but uh, the direction we were pointing has changed. So we should still be focused on the same thing. See? You know, we're looking at this from above. It's hard to tell what's going on. Right now we're looking at it from below. We may have to clean that up later. But this will work fine for now, and we will go ahead and uh, do much more with it later. Alright, see you next time.